Okay, welcome to the tutorial for the up and coming Friday night fun night with Sensei Thomas doing groundwork. This here is my groundwork pillow dummy that I've got that I've made out of pillows and clothes and we're going to teach you how to make it, okay? Time to make our pillow buddy. Here's what you'll need. You'll need a pillow. You'll need a hoodie or a normal jumper if you don't have a hoodie, but preferably a hoodie. You will need some tracky pants and if possible, tracky pants with a cord. You will need four spare towels. If you don't have any spare towels, that's fine. You can just use, uh, I guess you can use, use more clothes, put more clothes in it, because this is going to be to fill the arms and the legs out, okay? You will need a belt. It doesn't have to be a karate belt, but karate belts, uh, you know, are cool. And you'll need something to secure the sleeves and the bottom of the pants at the end. I'm going to use my protective equipment, my gloves and, and foot, feet pad. But if you don't have pads, you could use like a bands, you could use a bit of tape, you could use a hair tie, you could use string, anything to tie it up. Okay, let's get started. Okay, step number one, get your tracksuit pants and put them on your pillow. Then tie them up. Nice and tight. Cool. Step number two. Grab your hooded jumper and put your hooded jumper over the top of the pillow so it also covers the pants. All the way. Very good. Starting to look like a man already. Okay, now get your belt and you're gonna tie it on around the waist of your pillow, making sure. So here's the line of my tracky pants here. So I need to be below that line of the tracky pants. So I'm gonna tie it nice and tight so it doesn't come apart. I'm gonna tie the belt up. We go all right the next step is we have to fill the arm so what we're going to do is we're going to grab one of our towels and we're going to repeat this with both arms and both legs okay so we're going to put it down line it up and we want to make it so it's a little bit longer than the sleeve there you go you know fold the sleeve in just a little bit at the end, and then make it a little bit longer. A little bit longer than the sleeve. Fold the top end in, so it's a bit thicker at the top. And I'm gonna roll it up nice and loose. And once I've done that, I'm gonna shove it up the arm. All the way to the shoulder. go very good now repeat that with the other arm and both legs okay fantastic now that you've done that part what we're going to do now is we're going to secure the ends so uh, the, the towels can't come out so like I said I'm going to use my gloves but you can use anything you want so what we do is we just tuck the towel up a little bit, we fold the sleeve over, and then we use our elastic, our shoelace, our tape, whatever you want to use, just to keep it there. So there's one. And there's two. And do the same thing with the legs. Exact same thing with the legs.
Fantastic. All right, now, the last step, and this step only applies if you have a hoodie, is we need to build a head. Now, if I had a soccer ball or something around, it would probably be better, or a football, but I didn't, so I got creative. You can scrunch up some paper if you want. Um, yeah, use, use a plastic bag, blow it up, blow, use a balloon if you want, just be careful with it. But what I'm using is a focus mitt and a head guard. So I'm putting the head guard on the focus mitt, and then all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tuck it in to the hood of the hoodie. And then once it's in there the way I like it, I'm just gonna grab the string of the hood, pull it tight, and do another bow. All right, how easy was that? And now you've got yourself a buddy for the Friday night class. Okay, cheers.